Even better than I was the yeah. last time, baby. Ooh, 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 ooh. We'll be back. I'm good. What's up, family? Welcome back. I'm Trinity. If you're new here, if you want to join my family, if you want to be invited to the family reunion, y'all for real, we really gonna have a family reunion. Just wait. But if you want to be invited to the family reunion, you gotta hit that subscribe button because you gotta be family to be invited to the family reunion. <laughs> to be honest, I didn't know what I was going to record today. Uh, I still don't know. <laughs> right now at this exact moment, I put a poll on um, YouTube actually. I don't know if you guys know how to um, see it. If you're subscribed, then you will see it. But right now it's really close between roasting Coachella outfits or roasting prom dresses. I just posted it, not that many people voted. But I'm going to go on a limb here and go for the winning team, which is the um, ugly prom dresses. Today, we're going to roast some people. Prom is just around the corner. So we're going to go ahead and um, we're going we gonna to try to save some people before prom. Okay. Let's see. All right. First picture. This is going to get my high blood pressure up, y'all. I think they made this all out of duct tape, some type of fabric that's just not cutting it. Y'all probably was walking in extra loud, extra squeaky. This is not cute. I get I get the theme, okay? I know what they was trying to accomplish, but it's a no for me. Like, <sighs> what is that? This guy's excited for it tonight. This is actually embarrassing. I don't know how old she is, but I know she's too old. Too old to be put in Twilight. Cause that's not what it is. What's his name? It's not Josh. What's the guy's name? What's the vampire name? Cause I'm a fan of Twilight. It's a good movie. But honey, not to go to prom with. Like, come on. Oh gosh. And are those lights? Oh. Black folk, I, I now. This is funny, actually. <laughs> this is kind of funny because, okay, you wanted to take two girls because you, because you a pimp. I get it, and you got half of you that's purple with the purple girl, half of you blue with the blue girl. First of all, what type of girl would want to even be this for prom? Not me. Hello, ladies. Nobody ain't trying to be number two. <laughs> Nobody ain't trying to help your pimping ways. Okay, like what? Who agreed to this? I wonder if they're friends. I personally think this is cheesy, corny, maybe for Halloween. Maybe for Halloween, but definitely not for prom. Prom is supposed to be, it's supposed to be creative, but also it's supposed to have a nice, elegance to it at least that's how i see it mm. next Ugh. why sister why sis why who who told you this was okay who told you that this was okay your mom your grandma your sister your friends your boyfriend your boo who who said that this was okay. Who juiced her up, bruh? Now, if this is something that she wanted, then I, you know, look. I don't know, bruh. I think that's a jacket. I think it's a jacket. I don't think that's part of the dress. So, man, girl, just take that jacket off of UBI. Right. Out here looking like a, a dangerous mermaid. I bet you she got into a lot of fights. A lot of fights. Cause she was just poking people. And I know for me, cause you know I'm short. Oh, uh, we. Put them up, bruh. You know, good away. You shouldn't be coming up in here with these pokey things, messing up people's hair. No. I bet you had to fight. I bet you had to fight prom night with all this. But the dress, I don't know, man. The whole dress, throw the whole dress away because it does kind of give like a mermaid feel to it. But I think the um the lower part of the dress should have been lower. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. I don't like it. Okay. And you know what? I'm not even I'm not even that upset about this one. Let me tell you why. Because he has on a suit. It goes with her dress. They actually had a theme behind their outfits. They actually said, you know what? We're going to go camouflage. We like hunting. 
I'm assuming that they like hunting. I mean, if this is what they're passionate about and this is what they do together and this is who they are, I think it came together nicely. The dress isn't ugly. This isn't something that I would wear, but the picture and the fact that it just goes together, I'm okay with this. I'ma let y'all off. And it came together and it makes sense. You can definitely tell a little bit about them through this picture. And you know what, I respect that. Bruh. Bruh. Look here. If you know me, then you know my favorite color is yellow. I live for the color yellow. It is my favorite color. Oh, but I am so upset about this. Mm, I mean, <laughs> the picture looks photoshopped. I'm not sure if I'm not sure if this is her um, body type. I'm not really sure. But what is, is that connected to the dress? The gray, the theme going on here is gray and yellow. But they're not even matching the same yellow. And honestly, on my prom, I wouldn't, my, my prom day wasn't even matching the right coral with me. So what can you do? But, um, I don't know, and they're holding hands. Oh, he's smiling, but she looking. She looking away from the camera. She she probably not feeling it. But I don't like this. I don't like the shoes. I don't like the combination. Yellow and um gray. Mm mm. Excuse me. That combination. I don't know. That's more of like interior design. Interior. I cannot talk today. Interior design and the height difference. Girl, you know good and well, you are not supposed to be taller than your date, okay? Now, if you're just naturally taller than your guy, then okay, you can't help that. But if you can help it, it would be nice for you to probably consider that if you're gonna be taking prom pictures. It'll just, it'll just look better. I'm sorry, I'm just keeping it real, bro. I don't want nobody to get their feelings hurt. I'm just saying my opinion, I'm nobody. All right, I'm nobody, I'm just over here just saying my two cents, don't even, Mm -mm. Can I back out now? Can I just back out of this video? Can I? <laughs> nope, I'm not. I already started recording. <laughs> Let's just move on from this picture, but I am disappointed. A person that loves yellow, I am disappointed and I feel like this could have been done better. And you know what? One more thing about this picture. I see people in the back. Who told them this was okay? Next. First of all, how old is this picture? It has to be old. No one will, no one, I don't think anyone will do this today. Maybe they will. <laughs> but why? You can, you can have your baby belly and still look cute, bro. I know how I would work it. But this, this is not the way to go. Your baby gonna be just fine, covered up. You don't need to let the whole world hang. By the way, I am pregnant. We all know you pregnant, sis. We all know. First of all, she's not smiling. She's not happy about this. It's like she was forced to go like, uh, I ain't wanna go, but everybody wanted me to be here. It looks as if it was a nice prom dress and then she was just like, uh, my stomach's too big. And then she just cut a hole. Cut a hole and then say, you know what? Whatever. It ain't cute, sis. It ain't cute. It's not. I'm not gonna front sugar. I ain't fronting or sugarcoating up in this video, okay? I'm giving my opinion, period. Not cute at all. It's not cute. And then you got the line. I don't know what that line is called. Let me know below. The dark line is called something. Every woman that's pregnant, they get the line. They <laughs> Okay, we all can agree that maybe she was a glass. <laughs> maybe she was electrocuted before this bitch. Next, 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 please. Um, 
I don't like this dress. It is ugly to me. I feel like it didn't have to be ugly though. Cause the color combination with the, um, I don't know if those are rhinestones, whatever it is, it could have worked out, but the design and I don't know. I just don't like the dress. I don't know why, what is, what's so fun about duct tape? Oh, they kind of have this sticky note, duct tape, retro type of thing going on. I just, I just think it's not appropriate for prom unless they had a prom theme, especially if it's bouncing off of your prom date then clearly there was a vision that they had and they just did what they wanted to do because this was like a DIY project. Bruh. Bruh. Am I'm seeing this right. Y'all seeing this? It, this we, we both seeing this? Okay. You know what, after, what is it, Janelle Monet? after she came out with her little, with her little video, I was just kind of like, you know what, I'm not even surprised. I'm not surprised for prom, no, no, honey. Now the thing is, they really broke it down. I'm talking like detail. If you were ever curious to know, now you know. I bet you a lot of guys played around with their dresses. Okay, next. Honey. <sighs> Let me, z I don't even want to zoom in. I'm good, <laughs> I'm good. But let's just, let's give it up for the girl in the pink dress. Cause she working. She working it, y'all. But um, her friend, who told her that this was okay? Girl, are those panties? Girl, you got on, you don't have on any clothes. And how did they even let you into prom? For real, for real though, y'all. Like, how did they even let her in? Because if I was a teacher, you know me, I would've been strict. I would've been like, uh-uh, nope. You need to turn right back around. This is inappropriate. We don't want to be smelling nothing because, girl, you got too much skin showing. I'm just, why? Why, sis? Why, like, why? Why did you think this was okay? This is not cute. This is not cute. And look at the guy behind. I bet there was a whole lot of pervs just trying to peek at her. I don't like to feel like a piece of meat. And she definitely put herself in a position to um, be looked at, but I don't know. You didn't need to cut a hole out for the belly button though, honey. Just saying, she didn't need any cutouts. <sighs> this is the type of thing where if you blink, if you blink real fast and close your eyes, you're like, oh yeah, that's cute. Oh yeah. But then when you keep your eyes open, then you kind of like, mm, like first of all, homeboy, his suit could have been a little bit more crispier. Okay, like you just, I don't know what that is. This looks like a bathing suit and she just used a cover up. That's what it looks like. It doesn't look like an actual dress. And you know what, maybe she made it herself. Maybe she was on a budget, I don't know. But this isn't something, I don't know, it just looks, I wish I saw the whole dress. I feel like maybe she has a sleeve on the other side, but it's just not working for me. And it's probably because of the top part just looking like a random polka dot bra. <sighs> I don't know, man. I feel like a lot of these people was making their prom dresses and that's all cool and all that, but look, But one thing's pretty cool about this is the hood. He has a hood and she has a hood, I believe, in the back. And I don't know why I've always been a fan of, you know, hood attachments. 
But that's probably like the coolest thing about this. That's about it. If she was gonna go with the hood, then she should have just kept it kind of sporty. I don't know. I just feel like she made her dress. And they got a limo in the back, honey. I don't know who paid for that limo. Your mom, you, your, 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 your date. But uh, money should have been put into uh, maybe your dress. I shouldn't have been spending no money on no limo. And ooh, ooh, this was 2008. Yeah, there ain't no excuses. Uh, moving on. This was a complete fail. Uh, moving on. All right, now look. Wait, frat girl. Okay, I'm gonna just keep it real. She ruined her dress by putting that on the back. I know she was trying to take it back. You know, when they had the, uh, the letters, the uh, juicy on the booty. Oh man, y'all. I was, ooh, I had some. I had some outfits. I get it, I get it, sis, I get it. But this don't work for a prom date, man. This don't work, this don't work for prom. Next. Okay, oh, all right. Well, look, see, all right. They had a vision. Uh, you know what's so funny? They really do look like they love America. You won't catch any black folk rocking this to prom this year. Ooh, ooh, she got some nice legs though. Get a sister her props on that leg day. Let's see here. Ooh, no. Did you re- Nigga. Hey, did you really draw hard on your sneakers? On your white sneakers? I don't know if these are Air Forces. Ooh. Talk about dedication. Relationship goals. Next. You know, I've seen this picture before. I think this is the picture that started off with this whole ratchet prom dress situation. <sighs> this is just ghetto, bruh. Maybe she really loves Winnie the Pooh. And you know what? I, I like I like Winnie the Pooh too. You know, I grew up on Winnie the Pooh. But this is just taking it to a whole nother level it's just ratchet and ghetto it's just like dude why you have why i just want to know why who else i just want to know why like what inspired you because if there's a good old thick story about why they got winnie the pooh on them then okay we can let it ride because everything got a story right <laughs> if it got a story then then it's okay right I think it's corny. Okay, so last one. This is actually what I've been waiting for. I saw like a picture and I was just like, yo, I got, I, I have to figure out what's what's going on with this. Why? I don't know. We, we gonna just figure this out together because Okay, so she's going viral for her prom theme, not because everyone loves her idea, but because it's in a casket, okay. And this is her introduction. Let me just pause. Okay, let me let me just pause real quick. First of all, she looks beautiful. Beautiful dress, beautiful hair. But why? I mean, I it is a uh, dramatic entrance. We got to give it to her for that. <laughs> all right, we have to give it to her for that. She wanted to go viral. She did want attention in she definitely got the attention, but why though? It looks like she got a whole lot of um, negative feedback on this. My thing is let people do whatever they wanna do. It was extra, it was too much, but people can do what they wanna do. People can go to prom, how they wanna go to prom, but everyone's gonna have an opinion about your dress. And that's just 
straight facts. People are gonna have an opinion, and I shared my opinion. No one should be offended, no one should be crying, and they feelings is not that deep. I'm gonna show you guys my prom dress. Y'all can roast it if y'all want to. It don't matter to me, I don't care. Now you don't feel alone, okay? If you were offended, you shouldn't be offended anymore. But I'm done here, I hope you guys enjoyed. Shout out to these people for being part of the notification squad. If you want a shout out, you just gotta hit that notification bell, let me know below. Make sure to be bold, brave, and beautiful on prom night. Let me know if you're going to prom, let me know any details, just let me know. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, I do be going live randomly. I'm doing a question and answer video, so follow me on Instagram. And that's it y'all. I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye!